Young Simon the Harry Bottom was born in the rolling hills of Anatolia, the youngest of 64 children. By the time he came of age, his family's modest farmstead was being raided over 500 times per year by the forces of the great Khan Purchud Durktug, who led a mighty host of over three horse archers. Tired of inaction, young Simon joined his local Thame army and amazed his fellow troops with his innovative strategy of not running away immediately. He was declared emperor and engaged in a civil war to usurp the incumbent, Constantine the Fifth Sixth, who had himself usurped his predecessor, Michael the Tax Cheat, the previous year. After a long, bloody conflict which saw millions die and most of the Empire's hinterlands seized by rival powers, Simon emerged victorious and had the defeated Constantine blinded, skinned alive, dismembered, cooked, and served to a Bulgarian swineherd in what was regarded as an unusually lenient punishment by Byzantine standards. The war was immediately followed by the Simonian Plague, a great onset of deadly disease which killed further millions and saw the Empire's economy collapse. In an attempt to mitigate the damage, Simon announced a tax increase of 0.005% on all landowners with estates larger than a thousand acres. This caused widespread rioting and unrest, and Simon met his end being torn apart by an angry mob, which included his wife, his children, the patriarch, his horse, and the Bulgarian swineherd who ate Constantine. Simon was succeeded as emperor by the aforementioned Bulgarian swineherd, whose sweeping legal and financial reforms saved the empire and made it the dominant power in the Mediterranean once again until he was blinded by his wife and exiled to a monastery on Syracuse, which collapsed into the sea the following year. All in all, Simon the Harry Bottom was Emperor of the Romans for a grand total of 47 minutes, by far the longest reign of his dynasty.